Hello, I'm Randall Rompai. I'm going to show you my nighttime routine. Are you ready to go to bed with me? For me, I think because of my work, I like to use products that don't have a lot of weird stuff in it. So uh, a brand that I use a lot, and you're going to see that most of the things I use are from them, is Medicaid. First of all, I don't do this every day. I wish I did, but I'm simply too lazy most of the time to constantly do this. I also think that you should adapt your skincare routine to how you feel your skin looks or feels in the moment. I also think it's good to sometimes let your skin rest. My own skin is quite basic. I get like, depending on where I am in uh, my menstrual cycle, depending on the weather, the climate, how much I'm flying, it changes a little bit, but most of the time it's not that sensitive, it's not that oily. So yeah, let's do it. I put on a little bit of makeup for you guys, <laughs> so I can take it off. Normally, I don't really wear much makeup, but of course when I work, I get a lot of makeup and a lot of different products. So I think then it's very important to clean your skin. What I like to use is this, Medicaid's Cream Cleanse. For me, it's good because it doesn't dry my skin out. It doesn't feel like you come out of the shower to you cleaned your face and you feel like a raisin that's just like So what I use here, oh. <laughs> What I use is a pad that's reusable. You can put it in the washing machine, which is a bit better for the environment than the cotton pads uh, that you buy in the supermarket. And I just go like everywhere. I like to make strange faces. Makeup artists always make fun of me because when they put on my mascara, I'm like, and I can feel it's like a little bit prickly, but that's all right. I kind of like that. I feel like it's doing something. So now it's all over my face. Then you take a cloth and with some hot water, you can take it off. Now I'm wearing clothes, but sometimes I like to do this topless so I can also take my neck and a little bit my chest. Um, but today we're not gonna do a topless, I'm sorry. I'm gonna put my hair up because actually I think that's much easier. Okay, look. Now we can see the face. So then I'm gonna now use this. It's called Press and Glow. It's a toner. To be honest, I don't really know what it does, but it feels nice on my skin. I like it because it burns a little bit. You can see I'm turning red. I turn red very easily. That's like my first reaction to anything is turning red. And you can see, I mean, my skin is so transparent. That's also, I mean, we're doing the nighttime routine, so for now it doesn't really matter. But one thing I think that's very important for your skin is sunscreen, because sun really damages your skin, especially if you have a skin like me, you basically cannot live without SPF. Then, now, my face is super clean, and now we're gonna do this one. This is the C Tetra Intense Serum with vitamin C. Put a few drops on your hand. Go like that, warm it up. And what I like to do is to really massage my face. I'm quite expressive. And of course, also with the job that I do, I feel like I use these muscles so much. The strongest muscles in my body. Then, my favorite tool is this Hayu stone. I hope I pronounce it right. Hayu, Hayu. It's a jade stone. And because of the shape, it's a very nice way to massage your face. And when I travel a lot, this really helps to sort of get rid of all the excess liquid. Massage it out of my face and down my neck. And like that in the morning you wake up and you don't even recognize yourself. You look so good. Start with my jaw. And then I go like this. 
Now you can see already I'm turning even more red than I already was. <laughs> because all the blood is coming to the surface, which is really good. And here, those points, ooh, this feels nice. And then at the end, you go down your neck. Even if you're having a stiff neck, if you laid in like a weird position during the night, the night before, um, like I did last night, ooh, this feels really good. Done. Okay, next step. I'm gonna use this one, Ultimate Recovery Intense. Sounds like I'm extremely damaged, <laughs> which is true. And this is just a very, very moisturizing thick cream. For me, especially, it's also quite soothing. So if I had a job, for example, with a lot of makeup changes and I can feel my skin is a bit like, what was that? That was too much, getting a little bit irritated. This is great. Put it like this, a little drop, like a little pee. You don't use, you need to use much for this. And your neck too, don't forget your neck. And your chin. I always feel this part gets a little bit dry. I always give this part a little bit of extra love. Then, for dry lips, I like to use this. Lucas Papa Ointment with papaya. Next step is for my hair. Because my hair gets quite dry with all the flying, what I like to use is this. Rodin by Racine. It smells so good. And I put it in those dry ends. Okay, hair is ready, face is ready, hands. I don't know about you, but since this pandemic started, my hands are constantly like two pieces of sanding paper because I wash them so much. So I like to use this from Chanel. La crème texture riche. Just rub it all in. Don't forget like here because that I also wash my hands there. Okay. Well, people, I think we've uh, made it all the way through. 